Well, now we are going to hear from two of the newest civilian astronauts. Oh, and they just happen to be mother and daughter. What a journey. Less than 24 hours ago, Keisha Shahaf and Anna Mayers made a historic launch into space, becoming some of Virgin Galactic, Galactic's first tourist passengers. And get this, they won their seats. And folks, Keisha and Anna are joining Yay! us now. They're uh, near that launch site in New Mexico. Good morning. Good morning. Congrats Good morning. on your out of, yeah. out of this world experience. Oh, my gosh. Keisha, let me start with you, because I, I know that in the past you said you've dreamed about being in the sky like this. What does it feel like now being back on Earth after such an incredible ride? Good morning. Thank you so much for having me here. And good morning to Antigua as well. Um, it's a, such an amazing journey, just the whole adventure, the rocket boost and just being in in space, just looking back at our planet and experiencing the free feeling of just floating. That was just super amazing. And it just felt so natural. It just felt so beautiful and so much peace just to just be in that stillness and just see our beautiful home and that love and, and, and freedom and connection that is felt is just so amazing. And I know that's going to be with me forever. And to share that with my daughter is just such a miracle as well. Mm. Anastasia, you know, that's, you're a space lover just like your mom. Uh, you two broke a lot of firsts being up there, first females from the Caribbean to be in space, the first mom-daughter du duo. You, Anastasia, you're the youngest. And what I noticed in watching that video is that when you were all weightless, this quiet, that nobody yeah. said a word, mm. what... What was that moment like? Um, I have a very busy mind, and in that moment, it was absolute silence. Mm. Um, I don't think I've ever felt such peace before. Mm. <laughs> and what was it like sharing it with your mom? It was incredible. I don't think I would have wanted to share such an amazing moment with anyone else. It's brought us a lot closer together. I woke up this morning. You guys were all over my social media feed. Those braids flying in the air give me life. Uh, Keisha, the two of you trained for this moment. But did the training prepare you, or is there really no way to prepare for what you guys just ex experienced? The training definitely did prepare us, <laughs> especially you want to get in your seat right, you know, at the right time mm -hmm. <laughs> when that boost starts again. <laughs> <laughs> what did that boost so feel like? That I really appreciated. <laughs> The boost was amazing. It was such a beautiful, like, pressure on the chest, like a roller coaster. And if you love that kind of adventure, you would love that. <laughs> and I truly loved it. And also just that presence, being very present, mindfulness practice also helps because it can go very fast, but it slows down at the same time where you can just be there and just take it all in. So that was amazing. <laughs> You mentioned your people in Antigua uh, a few moments ago. Sir Richard Branson was actually at a watch party with your mom and the rest of your family and friends in Antigua and Barbuda uh, during the space flight. W what's your message to, to the folks back home who have been watching <laughs> this historic journey? Oh, wow. Antigua has given me so much love <laughs> and I'm so grateful to Richard Branson for looking after my mom. She looks so happy. <laughs> and um, <laughs> if dreams can come true for me, it can come true for any of you, anyone, anyone on this planet. And I just want to let everyone home know, please dream. Mm. Don't think that your dream is too crazy and, and weird. You can do it. And once you have that, you make that decision, everything aligned for, it, for your dreams to come true. <laughs> Amen. Here, here, Keisha and Anna. It could not have happened for uh, two more deserving folks. This is, we're just we're we're smiling right along with yeah. you. Thank you so much for sharing your journey with us. Thank you for having us. Oh, Thank that's you. Great. All right. Wow. Thank you. Out of this world. Thank you, ladies. Wow. Can you imagine? You know, we talked with Sir Richard Branson. He was mm -hmm. here right? before all of this. I mean, kudos to him. Yeah. You know what I mean? Seriously, for. I mean, there are a lot of people he could have picked, and yeah. everybody is worthy. So I think this is just the beginning, guys. Yeah. Yes, it is. It's really terrific. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.